Hi all, welcome to the review of Tanoshare for me key which will allow you to remove iCloud log from your Apple device. This video is sponsored by Tanoshare. Also they did provide me with a 5 license code which I can give away for you guys. So, so to enter the giveaway just comment down below your thought regarding this Tanoshare for me key. So let's jump into this uh, review. So first of all, to use this Tanoshare for me key, there are some requirements and some limitations. So we will look at that and we will focus on the application. So the requirements for using this Tanoshare for me key is like this. And now for the limitation and the limitation include, first of all, you need to jailbreak your Apple device and you can follow the guide provided by this Tanoshare which is very easy to follow and the second thing is that after using this Tanoshare for me key to remove the iCloud log you can't use any cellular function that is you can't use your sim on this Apple device and if you use the sim you can't use it to call or to send message or for any network connection you can't use any cellular function and the second thing is that you can't use any iCloud features. You can still use new Apple ID and download apps from these app stores and use all that function. And the third thing is that if you update your iDevice after unlocking it with the, this Tanoshare for me key, then your device will be locked. You can't, then you might want to do all the steps to remove this iCloud lock. And the last limitation of this Tanoshare for me key is that if you restart your device, then you want to redo all the steps to remove the iCloud log as when you restart your device your phone will be locked again. So now you are familiarized with the requirements and the limitation of this Tanoshare for me key and now to use this Tanoshare for me key it is very simple and easy to use just open this Tanoshare for me key and connect your jailbroken I device. If your device is not jailbroken, you can follow the Tanoshare guide to jailbreak your device. On my research, it is the only jailbreak option available which you can use to jailbreak your locked I device. So use that guide to jailbreak your device. It is very easy to follow. They got all the picture and stuff, so you can easily follow that guide so after jailbreaking your device just connect your device to the standard share for me key just press next next and just press start remove to remove your icloud lock and your device will be unlocked and if you are stuck at this activation lock menu just press back button and just press next and your device will be unlocked so that's how you can use this tunnel share for me key to remove the iCloud lock and it is very simple and easy to use I was really amazed by the easiness of using this tunnel share for me key to remove the iCloud lock it is very simple to use before we jump into the verdict I'll show you guys one more limitation that is if you use this tunnel share for me key and restart your device then you want to start this entire step that's what I said earlier and the thing you want to notice that after restart you will lose your jailbreak because nowadays most of the jailbreak use semi tethered jailbreak that is you need your PC or laptop to boot your device in jailbreak mode and if you just restart your device then your device will boot into normal way. So if you restart your device then you want to start this entire process from the jailbreak step. So it will become more of an ACL if you restart your device or turn off the device and turn on the device. So you want to keep that in mind. Now for the verdict, from my experience of using this tunnel share for me key, it is very simple and easy to use. This is one of the easiest way to remove iCloud log from your iDevice. But the limitation of this tunnel share for me key is very high so if you can suppress this you can get this tunnel shell for me key if you can't you can then follow some other way to remove icloud log which i don't know so that's all about this tunnel shell for me key review guys i hope you guys find this video useful so you can make a better purchase decision so that's all about this video guys thanks for watching talk to you next one and don't forget to subscribe